Hi, my name's Chris. I live in Belcatta. One of my favourite things was doing drag racing. There's nothing like driving down a straight strip hitting 200 kilometres an hour in less than 400 metres. But I've always liked uh, drawing pictures, building model planes. Having a young person renting a room off me while I was in Europe, 17,000 kilometres away in the Channel Islands, expecting them to take care of the place. They invited all their friends over, had a big party, trashed the place. And that was the first time I'd ever left Australia. When I got home, I got home to a, a real mess. The owner blamed me and he evicted me and blacklisted me. So I sold all my possessions and bought a cheap van and decked it out with a bed, a TV and a fridge. For the first few weeks, it was almost like a holiday. My dogs were enjoying it, uh, being next to the beach and their favourite thing happens to be water. But as you went further into it, it started to get hard, depressing. There were times when I was homeless where I felt like taking my own life, thinking that there was no light at the end of the tunnel. And for at least a year, I couldn't see any light at the end of the tunnel. Because I knew I couldn't get a, a rental property, I knew there was no way of getting into a house. So at that time, my homelessness was endless. It was going to be for the rest of my life. The regulars that go down to the beach there would see me there and see me there on a daily basis. And so they would start bringing me coffee, breakfast, donuts in the morning. Multiple people that I've heard that were homeless down there the locals have taken a real shine to all of them and helped them out the best they can. I wasn't expecting people to help me, but I was grateful. But I didn't want to ask people. It was more ashamed. I was ashamed to ask people for help. My father and his friend, uh, his friend especially, decided to rent a house in his name, but I was also joint on the lease and we were approved. Well, now I run a charter vehicle business. I'm trying to expand my business and the first people I'm going to offer with work is people that are homeless. My main aim is to help people that are going through what I've been through. I was lucky I got through it, but I was a lot better off than a lot of other homeless people. Now, the best thing is we, we get people up and running as fast as we can, get them back on their feet so they're contributing to society and society is contributing to them.